Hi, I'm Kevin J. Withers with Team Sabeel. I'm here today to show you the brand new Sabeel knot. The reason we want to be showing you this today is because of how incredibly small in diameter it is. Obviously throwing Sabeel baits, you understand how important it is to make those long cast. With the Sabeel knot, it's super small diameter makes you and allows you to make those really long casts. The other benefits about the Sabeel knot is not only does it have the small diameter, but also the way it's designed is to give you 100% knot strength and your line to leader. Very, very important. This is the last connection you have to the fish. All right, here we're tying the Sabeel knot. Steps that you need to use and follow to tie this knot effectively to keep its 100% knot strength are as follows. You simply have an inch, inch and a half of your fluorocarbon leader and you have approximately 8 to 10 inches of drop for your braid. This is tying your braid and your fluorocarbon together and you simply start with this. You cross the two together, okay, again making an 8 to 10 inch drop down from the fluorocarbon leader. The first step is make one rotation behind the fluorocarbon leader, okay? The next step is bring your main line up and under your fluorocarbon leader. You continue this step 10 times. So here's my second, here's my second, here's my third, here's my third, here's my fourth, and so on, okay? We continue to wrap this up again 10 times. And as you can see, as I get closer here, the diameter of the braid is simply wrapping and weaving around the fluorocarbon leader. This is what gives this knot its incredible strength. All right, let's say we have our 10 wraps right here. At this point, you rotate it around, particularly if you're right-handed, and now you simply tie a simple overhand knot. This overhand knot is what you bring right to the end of the wraps. That essentially locks it. No slippage at this point. You come back again, you make three passes. One, two, three. And you slide this all the way back down to the end of the loop. Okay. Pass it through again. This is your one, three, two, one. So this is the second one. We pass it through twice. And then last, just a single. Okay, pull it snug. At this point, you grab your main line, you grab your fluorocarbon leader, and pull tight. That right there basically cinches your braid down onto your fluorocarbon leader. Okay, at that point, you come out here, you trim your fluorocarbon leader, let's say eighth of an inch, Okay, and you also trim your fluorocarbon, or your braid, like so. There is your Sabeel knot. As you can see, there is no single knot in your fluorocarbon leader. It is 100% knot strength right here with all the wraps in the braid that go onto the fluorocarbon leader. So right here, this can fly out of your guides very, very easy, nice and smooth, with no catch on any of the guides for that long distance catch you need, or that long distance cast you need. And that's essentially it. This will be on that.